Denise Welch is no stranger to a successful age gap relationship. In fact, there are 14 years between her and her own husband Lincoln Townley, and they've been married for more than a decade. The straight-talking Loose Women star didn't hesitate to wade into the debate around Alison Hammond's rumored new flame, a model and masseur who is more than 20 years her junior. This morning presenter Alison reportedly met the 6 feet 10 inches tall Russian David Putman when she booked in with him for a relaxing 150 pounds massage. Replying to the concerns of naysayers who claimed it could all end in tears, Denise exclaimed, it could also work out brilliantly well and be the best thing that ever happened to her. She added that her fellow ITV star is a fabulous woman who deserves everything. Her comments, published on Twitter, come after a source expressed their concerns in an interview with the Daily Mail. Obviously alarm bells go off when there's a 20-year age gap, whether that's when the man or woman is younger and there is someone involved who is rich. It is surely natural that there would be some concern, the source claimed. According to the Mirror, Alison is believed to have a net worth of between £1 million and £4 million, and is thought to have a very comfortable lifestyle. However, Denise has made it clear Shush is not one of those who is concerned. Following her remarks on Twitter, fans chimed in with similar stories of age gap love affairs. Nobody's concerned but hers, I wish her all the best, good for her. If a 30-year-old Russian gal showed interest in me, I'm not going to say no. Another fan chimed in. Another added, I hope Alison is very happy. She seems like a really nice person despite what keeps coming up on social media. The presenter was recently faced with a brutal backlash over being appointed to take over the late Paul O'Grady's role as host of For the Love of Dogs. Critics have argued that, as she doesn't have any dogs as pets herself, she isn't as passionate about animals as Paul, and isn't fit to step into his shoes. However, others have defended her, while also pointing out that the show is raising vital awareness for Battersea dogs and cats home, no matter who the host of it is.